Welcome back. Thanks for checking out this video. I'm going to be going over how to create bullet lists in your videos within Premiere Pro. So if you are in Premiere Pro and you're trying to create a bullet list like this for your video, I'm going to show you how in this example I've taken from an exercise program that we're working on here at 8482. So, you know, as you can see the example here on the right, uh, we have different layers and these three layers are what's making up the bullet list. Okay, and you guys are either going to need to add text to be very basic, which you can do with the text tool, grab the text tool and just go ahead and click and start typing. Or you can use something a little fancier like a motion graphics template. So in this case, I've used a motion graphics template. So it's actually animated. All right. And it adds a little bit more. So if you're looking to do that, pay attention. I'm going to be taking this um, blank example and going and customizing these motion graphic templates. So if you guys would like to follow along, um, I'm going to be adding some coaching cues from this list here. And I'm going to be using this motion graphics template, which I will link below, which you can get from motionarray.com. All right. So once you've imported the template, uh, which I've recorded in a separate video, if you're not familiar with importing motion graphics templates, I'm going to go ahead and just copy these layers um, over to this video and show you how you can customize and create this list. This is actually a Z press. So I'm going to be zooming up just so you guys can see a little bit better of what what we're working on here. And then the bold title is this top one you can always tell by either hiding um, or unhiding the text. And we can see here the text if we come up to essential graphics panels and we're on edit. All right. Um, if you guys did just import a template that you're working with, you would want to click that template and then drag it down. Um, but I'm just going to be showing you how to customize these bold titles. All right. So I'm going to go ahead and retitle this Z press and that's going to change the top um, animation. All right. I'm just going to copy this and then paste it um, on this second layer. So this is a trick that I like to do, um, which is a little advanced, but this animation, I really like the animation, but it doesn't go fast enough. So what I've done here is I've um, sped up the animation a little bit, and then I dropped my cut tool and then I slowed it down once it fully reached, um, you know, it's fully animated form on the left. I just slowed it down to 0.1%, which I did by right clicking, going to speed duration. Then I changed that to 0.1, which really will slow out the animation completely. All right. So I use that trick a lot. Um, so once we've titled Z press, you're just going to want to go ahead and make your bullet list. So if we click on this first modern text bullet list, again, which I picked off of motionarray.com, you can use this scroll and just kind of look at what we have going on. So if you're working off a different bullet list or motion graphic, it might be a little different, but here we got text one that matches up here with this text. I could change the color of that if I wanted to. Then I have the number. All right. So we could put a, B, C, D, E, F, or we can just do the numbers as I've done here and you can change the bullet color if you'd like as well. All right. So I'm going to come back and I'm going to paste that there and then I'm going to click on this guy, which is really the same. Um, just a different speed. So it's going to be, I separated it here with the cut tool. And so now we have our first cue. You're going to notice that only a certain amount of these words fit on each line. So I'm going to paste this on the second line, make sure the formatting is correct, and then copy and paste that into our other title here, which will update legs spread out, starting to see the position legs spread out. All right, so as you guys can see here, we got start and seated position, legs spread out, grab barbell outside shoulders, shoulders packed and core in, press barbell overhead, pull head through the window, bring barbell back down. All right, so this, I'm going to go ahead and hide um, these bottom layers just so that you guys can see this animation. All right, so we have the, I'm going to mute the music. So we have the title come in and then these coaching cues or bullet points that you're going to add to your video kind of animate in. All right. So that's what the whole thing is going to look like once you're done. If you want to stick around, I'm just going to be formatting this a little bit. So I'm going to slide this over. So it starts at the very first frame and I'm going to slide these guys over since they're at 0.1 speed. 
slide them all the way over to the right, um, they're going to remain kind of in that frame. A lot of motion graphics templates will animate out. So I'll cut in the beginning, cut in the end, take that middle point where it's not moving, change the speed duration of point 0.1 as I showed, and that's going to slow it down. So it's going to last the whole video. Kind of a little trick that we came up with. All right. So that's the full exercise. I'm going to press X, make sure this is unmuted before exporting. And you guys can take this um, along with that template if you like that I'll throw in the description below and add bullet points to your videos. Hope this helped out. Drop a comment. Let us know what you think.